how to market your products and services and generate sales for free using YouTube. Hi guys, it's Sam Day here from daytips.com and in this video, I just wanted to talk to you guys for a second. Um, we just reached 11,000 subscribers here on the channel on YouTube, so thank you so much for subscribing and for liking the videos, for commenting, uh, for sharing the videos. It means so much to the community that I'm trying to build here on YouTube, so a, a huge thank you. And I thought that this would be the perfect opportunity to really speak about YouTube and how to create a YouTube channel for your business. So whatever you're doing, whatever product you're offering, whatever service it is that you're offering, you can start a YouTube channel to help you to promote that. My last video here on the channel was um, how to generate sales and how to drive traffic to your website for free. And in the comments section, uh, two people left a comment basically saying that they want, wanted me to do a more in-depth video on YouTube marketing and how to grow a, an audience on YouTube to help you to push your business, whatever it is that you're trying to sell. So that's really what I want to tackle in this video. And I want to just um, make it kind of in-depth, but I just want to speak to you about some of the things that I've done uh, right, some of the things even that I've done wrong, some of the things that you can do to help you grow your business on YouTube without spending much money. Um, and also just as a note as well, if you have a video request that you want me to sit down and just kind of do in this format where I'm just breaking it down and sharing my experiences with it or my knowledge on that particular topic, then leave me a comment in the comment section and let me know um, what video you'd like me to do, what you're struggling with, whether it be SEO, whether it be paid marketing, and I'll do my best to get a video out as soon as possible to kind of help you guys out with that. You know, I'm trying to, uh, this year, I'm trying to do more in-depth videos, more webinars, uh, kind of just helping you guys more one-to-one -one, um, with your businesses, with your marketing, and help you to really make 2019 what it's supposed to be. So let's get straight into it. Um, my very first tip, my very first piece of advice with regards to YouTube marketing is to get started. Um, I've had two clients this year that have started doing videos. And for me, um, it, it's amazing. Actually, I've had three. I've had three clients that started doing videos this year. And um, they, they were worried about the production value. They didn't have a high quality camera. They were like, is it going to even be that great? And I said to them, look, literally, all you need to do is make sure you've got good lighting. You can use the camera on your phone to, to record and just make sure you're recording, maybe um, having a, a window uh, facing your face so that your face is bright and the camera will pick up that brightness. As long as your face is bright, then the camera will pick that up and then you can literally record. Um, so that's literally the basics and maybe try and get yourself a good, uh, good audio. So if there's a, a microphone, um, but normally if you're using your smartphone, then that's good enough for you to start. Don't think that you need this expensive camera to start here on YouTube. Literally, you can use a camera on your phone. Just make sure you have good lighting. Make sure the audio comes out good. Um, most uh, smartphones nowadays have good audio and, and a good camera anyway. So you shouldn't even be too fussed about that. So just get yourself started. Make sure your lighting is good and um, that the sound quality looks good and put it on YouTube and start just trying to become more confident on camera. Your very first few videos are not gonna be great, but you kinda just wanna keep putting those videos out there and as you keep putting them out there, not only are you, are you attracting an audience, but also you're going to get better on camera as well. So keep that in mind, um, don't let that be stopping you. A lot of people have so many barriers in front of them to start on YouTube, but just kind of start it if you don't have the gear. And then later on down the line, as you start to build a following and an income, then you can uh, kind of put the gear behind you as well. So that would def definitely be my first tip. I'd also say make sure that your videos are search engine friendly. Now I've done a lot of um, videos on SEO, but in particular, you want to use the Google Keywords tool and you want to research what keywords people are actively searching for. Um, I'll leave a link to the Google Keywords tool in the description down below, and I've spoken a lot about that tool here on the channel, um, but essentially you want to use that tool to find out what people are searching for in your industry. So whatever your YouTube channel is about, find those keywords, put those keywords in the title of your videos, in the description of your videos, in the tags of your videos, 
and you want to make sure that your descriptions are in depth as possible as well so don't just write you know a one liner in your description but be as in depth as possible make at least at least one paragraph if you can then use two paragraphs and use your keywords within that description. Make sure it's there two or three times in your description and it reads in a natural way as well. You don't wanna just kind of force it in there, but you wanna make sure that it reads really well as well when, um, when the search engines read it, but also when people read it as well. So make sure your keywords are in there, but also make sure that your videos it themselves are of high quality in terms of the content. So in terms of what you're giving to people, you're on YouTube to serve. So you shouldn't be on YouTube just trying to sell, sell, sell. You should be on there to serve a community of people. So you should be giving out really useful information, really useful advice, really useful um, maybe news if you are if you just wanna keep up with, keep people updated with industry news, um, then you should be doing that within your videos. What quality? can you provide what 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 really useful information can you provide in your videos that will keep people coming back and wanting to consume your content so really think about that um, when creating your youtube videos um, how can you can you do that and make sure you have a call to action as well in your videos you need to ensure that you're creating videos but you're telling people to take action in your videos as well. So you're not just creating videos for video's sake, but you're telling people to like, to subscribe, to share your videos. You're doing promotion within your videos and telling people to go to your website and to sign up for your newsletter or to buy your products or whatever it is that you want them to do. But make sure that there is some sort of call to action that helps to drive your business forward within your YouTube videos. Um, and another thing as well is consistency you want to ensure that you're really consistent on YouTube. So you're putting out, it's gonna take a while for you to start building an audience. Um, it's it's gonna take you some time and you need to be putting out videos regularly and often and you need both quality and quantity. You need quite a few, a lot of videos. They need to be as quality as they can be, so don't substitute your quality, but you need to be putting out a lot of content in order for you to really start generating um, a buzz for your YouTube channel. So um, essentially, having a YouTube channel for me anyway is very similar to um, having a blog as well on your website. So you wanna make sure that you have good images, use good images uh, for your thumbnail and um, as well for your YouTube channel art. So, you know, from the get go, use a, a, a software such as Canva. Canva.com is free, I'll leave a link in the description down below. And when you use Canva, you can actually create your own artwork. You can create your thumbnail image for YouTube, uh, your YouTube videos, and you can create your um, YouTube art as well. Um, so um, make sure you do that. Make sure your your thumbnails are attractive and they're appeasing and they make people want to actually come and subscribe and be a part of your YouTube community. So that's really important as well. And also engage with your community. There's so many YouTube channels I see out there that they, they, they have a small following and they don't even respond to their comments. And it's really important that you respond to people's comments as best you can. Obviously, as you grow, it's gonna be difficult and there's gonna be a few that slip through the cracks, but you wanna make sure that you're responding to people if they have questions and you're answering and you're being helpful as well. Because if someone leaves a comment, then that means that they're engaged in your video and you wanna be you wanna make sure that you're engaging back and being a, a participant in your own community as well. So um, that's super important as well. So hopefully these YouTube tips have really helped you out. Um, I'm gonna be doing more in-depth tutorials about YouTube marketing and how to actually do your SEO more effectively, how to write your descriptions more effectively, what type of content you should be putting out on YouTube for your specific business or whatever you're trying to sell. So make sure you're subscribed to this channel if you're not already and click that bell notification button as well so you get notified every time I put out a new video. Make sure you leave a comment if you have any questions and I'll do my best to answer that. I also have the formula which you see here behind me. This is the formula to generating online sales which is called traffic plus conversions equals sales. And if you don't understand what that means, then you 100% 
need to go and download that formula. It's completely free. I'll leave a link to it in the description down below and there should be a place for you to click it somewhere on this screen as well. So make sure you go and download that if you have not already. But hopefully this video helped you out and if it did, then please click the like button down below and make sure you share this video with a friend. If you have any additional questions or comments, then leave them for me in the comment section. But until next time, watch some of my other great videos. Make sure you subscribe to this channel for more awesome business related content. Have a great day, make sure you download the formula and I'll see you soon.